5.30 in the morning and uh, just getting the bike, well the bike's all ready now, we're just going up to Ambleside to the Lake District. <laughs> Right, good morning, hope you're well. We are on the sunny Lake District. Absolutely beautiful here, well done Lee. I met up with a peaky biker and uh, Lee Ballytron and he has picked the most beautiful spot ever. It's red hot, absolutely scorching. I've just put my tent up as well, so I'm actually boiling hot. So we've got a bit of a, I think we're going for a bit of breakfast and then we've got a bit of a, bit of a ride which uh, I think Brian's put in his sat nav. He was on about off-roading yesterday. I don't know what he's got in store. But we shall see. So what's a bit of a, an off-road section get in here, to be fair. So we are just here for one day. So I'm, I'm not going to be in front because I'll just get us lost. I'll end up back home like I did this morning when we flip flipping uh, MRA or My Route app tracker thing. Totally messed it up. Decided to change the route and put waypoints in. And then it just... Just didn't want to work. I think it says we're turning right. So yeah, let's see what today brings us, shall we? But uh, yeah, put me tent up. Tent's all gone up. It didn't take long. Thank you boys for helping me put that up. It's one I used in the Alps many years ago, so it's um, seen a few things up. Do you know, it's absolutely stunning here. Look at it. So I think we are actually going to get some breakfast now from somewhere probably get my vents open as well. I wasn't going to bring me Gore-Tex but it says there's a bit of rain coming on Sunday but I'll be off so Sunday's tomorrow I'll be off anyway as soon as I can. I really wish I'd have came yesterday now I'd spent two nights here because it's just awesome. The adventure begins eh? Oh, look at this road. Awesome. Don't know where this is going to take us at the top, but we're climbing. Can't really see it on camera, but it's quite a steep one. Look at that. Oh, we should have bought the drone now. Mate, that was uh, some good uh, navigation from you, actually. Like I say, I'm, I'm using the sat-nav, uh, my route app on my phone, and I've never used it before. But, if I'm being brutally honest, if you wear glasses, you need to wear glasses when you're reading your phone, because I've missed about four turnings. Mate, that's what your car is for, to talk to you. I'm listening to my music, though. Do you know that MRA let me down this morning? Did it? Yeah. Because oh. I tried to do it on the laptop, Got a, so I wasn't touching any motorways. And for some reason, the arrow was on the screen, but no road, it was telling me directions, but it just kept wanting me to go back home because that was the first waypoint. So I had to skip the waypoint to yeah. get back on track. I ended up just putting Google Maps on. <laughs> Are we seeing you? You right, mate? All good, routes are brilliant. Do you, know, do you know what was funny though? What? I, I put my uh, bike in a, what do you call it, Dynamic Pro. <laughs> just as I put it in, we turned down a road with moss all over it, so I'm like, into rain, <laughs> into rain mode. So what, what, what's the plan today then, Paul? So I've been sent a route, you, you sent me this route and it's like an off-road section up here. Have you, so, <laughs> have you got road, road tyres? Yes. <laughs> they're meant to be trail tyres, but they're not. 
yourself. It's all right, mate, because I don't like anything too gnarly anyway. So, Mark, can I just say? Yes, mate. Stop filming. Why? Stop talking. You can get the bruise, you can get the cake. <laughs> <laughs> but absolute. Oh, schoolboy ever, leave it your phone, with two mile time vloggers. Absolute. Absolutely stunning this. Beautiful. Baby, don't break me. Is it ideal? Yep. It's too fucking good to up here. I think Alls Water, we've just passed Alls Water down there. It's nice, it's a nice little, uh, nice place to be. I love that bike. Alright, Paul. Alright, mate. Alright, mate, you enjoying it? All good, yeah. Beautiful, Baron. Did you have to listen to him snoring last night? Yeah, but you've got to deal with him on the comms all day. So. <laughs> It's just, it's just nice to talk to somebody. I don't get to talk to anybody else. It's nice to have a conversation in the helmet, mate, isn't it? It is, mate. Beautiful. Look at this. I'll bring you some nice places, don't I? Is it now? I'm ready for a bit of cake. What are they? Half twelve? You don't eat normally. I don't. I'm going to read a bit too. I've got a mint. Do you want a mint? No, if they've been in your pockets next to Do you want place. a mint? No. You need one, mate. And you do. <laughs> you know. <laughs> So we just stopped for some coffee and I'm just getting abused, as always. Standard procedure. Standard procedure, so he reckons. You know what? It's quite funny seeing the same road four or five times, isn't it? It is, yeah. <laughs> and, then, start flying and then justifying it by saying, this is where the coffee stop was. <laughs> <laughs> and then back on the main road again. You make me laugh, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Right, so I'm following so, so I'm following a uh, a route that I've been sent, but I've obviously got my sat nav on as well, just uh, zooming in and zooming out, and I noticed coming past there that there's a coffee shop. Look at them boys, pity me. But yeah, so we've come to the coffee shop and having a brew. Just remember to uh, subscribe to the Peaky Biker. <laughs> 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 so I don't, I don't know if you can actually see that, you know. I don't think you can see that. That's a shame, mate. Let's just have a look over here. So that route there, look at that. <laughs> That's like, it's down here, change my mind. Or oh, it's up here, change my mind. <laughs> I think your mate's had you on a wild goose chase, mate. Yeah, but, but have some, see, see some nice views, are we? We have actually, yeah. Right, let's enjoy this. Kirkston passing. Look at that for a view. Stunning. That road we've just come up there is called the struggle. It was no struggle because all the cars were letting us pass, weren't they? <laughs> it's a pity about this pub behind this Kirkston Pass. It used to be open that, but I think it's been refurbed. 
beautiful. Fortunately, no, no shandy for us. It's bottles of water. Lee's bike, we're nearly having to lie down. Yeah. See BMW, they get tired. Yeah, they do, yeah. Big bikes. Get up there as well, behind there. Stunning. Right, so we are at the campsite and we are on the Guinness. Cheers. Got a lovely fire roaring. Tents up. There's Lee's. He's, a, he's an Indian. In his teepee. You got PK, look. Don't ask how he blew that one up. Probably out of his bum hole. And then you got mine over there. <laughs> and then we've got a lovely fire roaring, look at that. Courtesy of uh, Mr. Bailey Tron. Do you know do you know we've got um phone jack here? here? <laughs> <laughs> look up phone jack Lee. That is definitely give me a phone jacker face. But yeah, look at this. It is getting a bit cold now though, because that sun's going behind them mountains, but look at this. Awesome. What an amazing campsite. Why am I spinning that round when all I need to do, right? You just use my little joystick and pan. Yeah, but guys, you've already got a fleece on. Look at them, look at the hairs on them legs. <laughs> <laughs> they look like milk bottles. I'm going to put my... Looks like you're wearing your missus' leggings. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, looks like I'm wearing my missus' legs. <laughs> oh, it's back on me again. Full circle. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna have some uh, some Guinness because that's all we do is just like ride bikes. We've had some nice food as well, haven't we? Yeah. We had shoulder of lamb or was it mutton? Was it mutton or lamb? It was. It was lamb, wasn't it? Yeah. There's some weird looking lambs around here because they're all missing shoulders. How did you like your uh, chili con carne, peaky leaky meeky beaky? <laughs> Don't you've got left your keys in your top box, mate? <laughs> and then he's, uh, as you can see, he's um, supporting the latest fashion. <laughs> he's got his Spider-Man leggings on. I bet if you take his shorts off and that, they're like they are Spider-Man pajamas. <laughs> <laughs> Monstrosity like Crocs on. <laughs> These are called Crocs, not Crocs. <laughs> Do you know what though? You know, like people take the mick out of them, but they're supposed to be like really comfy, aren't they? Yeah. It's pity you didn't get any that fit you though. <laughs> they look about three times too big. I pinched these. So somebody else had the monkey feet in them, but I pinched them. <laughs> That's Do you nick him off Mac Ronald McDonald? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a pity we've just had one day here, but yeah, it's been great. I love today. You've had one day here. Yeah. I've had, okay. I've had two. <laughs> but it's been great. I'd definitely come here again. It's awesome. Yeah. It's really nice. Anyway, we're going to drink some more Guinness <laughs> and uh, see where we go. Might have to get something on because I'm getting a bit cold now. My nipples are coming through, cutting through my t shirt. Like monkey's fingers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've seen some of them today as well. We have seen some. I tell you what, this weather brings out. I'm not even going to go there. No. But yeah, it's been a very eye candy day today. I've enjoyed it. Good riding day as well. It's been a good riding day. Good banter as always. And we've even had a bit of off-road section to get to the tent, yeah. which were quite fun as well. So that's it. Buy yourself some Crocs. Yeah, <laughs> buy yourself some Crocs. Drink Guinness, buy yourself some gro Crocs and ride your bike. Yeah. And they, that's all you need. You'll be happy. You'll be happy. And wear a hat like phone jacker. So if you, any of you guys know whose hat this is, you should do if you're a motorbike rider, whose hat this is, leave a comment. What does it say on it? Is that going to give the game away? N no. That won't. No, I ain't going to tell you. But the colours... I'll push it up. So you, can, you can see both sides. Oh, it's so guy Martin. I've asked him to leave a fucking comment. Yeah.